Well, well, well. I don't even know where to start with this video. So let me just say, all right, let me just start from the top. If you hear gunshots, that's not really gunshots. That's my dumbass neighbors popping fireworks. But I think they got their holidays mixed up because fireworks are for 4th of July, not Memorial Day. When I'm done with this video, I'm going to go on out there and get them a piece of my mind. You feel me? Second of all, I'm going to be real honest with y'all. Daniel Gaffer gave me a headache. Because, you know, the beginning of this game, I was fine. You know, I had a, I had a, I had a lot of Derek Lively, right? Like, Derek Lively was my, like, sneaky piece. Obviously, he got hurt. But I was cool with it because I still had Gaffer. I don't, I don't understand what's wrong with that man. He's a starting center in the NBA. Now this is legit a dude that I had in my lineup that I'm, I'm, I'm crying about. Yes, yes. I, I don't understand. I don't understand Gafford. I don't understand his rotations. I don't understand anything. And I, 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 I can't wait for this playoffs to be over. So I don't gotta deal with Gafford again. I don't. I hope I don't gotta play him in the finals. I mean, yeah, we're gonna see him in the finals because they're gonna go play Boston. But I, I hope I don't have to roster him in the finals. I hate playing that guy. And when I do play him, it doesn't work out. Uh, <sighs> never mind. Never mind. Anyway, let me just um. Let's get on with this, with this, with this slate, so we can go on and get out of here. I'm not, I'm not trying to keep y'all guys on a holiday. I know y'all got things to do. You got Tatum up top. He's gonna take a million shots. You got to play him. He can't. He, he's probably unfadeable, unless he gets hurt or something. But you know, you got to play him. Jalen Brown, fourteen seven, in play. Obviously, Hallett. Well, we got to see what's going on with Halliburton. But if Halliburton is good to go, I still don't trust his health. Siakam, what do you play, like 30-something 30, 30 minutes? 36 minutes. I mean, you know, you're playing for your lives and your star player is out. And you're playing Siakam 36 minutes. You should be fired alone for that. You see what I'm saying? This is this is three games in a row that I don't understand what's going on in Indiana or going on with Indiana. And I, I see people trying to make excuses for Rick Carlisle. You need to miss me with that. Please. I'm not in the mood. Why is Siakam playing 36 minutes? You, this is life or death. Like you, you, you gave up in game two. You gave up in game two, beginning of the fourth quarter. Nobody told me nothing. Then you, then, then your, your guy gets hurt. Then you start Ben Shepard, right? With a, with a, with your chest out, with a, with, with, with your chest out, with your head held up high, and your, and your shoulders squared up, and your chest out. You start Ben Shepard like a goofball. Then you finally bring T.J. McConnell in the game. You guys get a lead. You get a big lead. You start the second half with Ben Shepard again, and you lose the lead. So how do you, how do you defend that? Somebody, how? Somebody help me. I'm confused. <sighs> then they say, then they say, I think I know more than the head coach. Oh, man, miss me with it. Not, not, no, not today. Not today. Not today. Miles Turner, 12K in play. Derek White up top, 11-7. Holidays in play. We need Holiday. When Holiday is aggressive, the team is different. Um, holi uh, An aggressive Holiday can absolutely be a captain, but you never know which Holiday you're going to get. Um, all right, let's just go over the captains. Tatum, Brown, Siakam, White, Holiday. Now, this is the thing with Horford. If they're gonna to continue to leave Horford on the three point line unguarded, he's gonna keep shooting those threes. I don't think he's gonna have a game like he did in game was it game three? 
I don't think he's going to have that again, but it's a, it's a thing you got to worry about. Um, he's going to be getting open threes all game long because knowing Rick Carlisle, he won't address that. So our, ca- our, our captains, Tatum, Brown, Siakam, Turner, if you must, White, Holiday, and then I'll put um, an asterisk next to Horford. If you're playing a lot of lineups, you want to be sneaky, you can throw Horford in there. If for some reason he decides to start McConnell, then you can throw McConnell at captain. McConnell's not a bad captain choice. The thing is, he's playing him like a bench warmer. Like, he's playing him like a scrub. He's not giving him extra minutes or anything like that. So, you know, McConnell should be out there 35, 37, 40 minutes. He's out there 29 minutes. And yet your starting point guard is out. Like, you got Ben Shepard out there all game long. My man put up 45 fantasy points in 29 minutes. And it's not about the minutes. It's not about the fantasy points. It's about the energy, like I keep saying. I keep saying it, and then I still get people defending Rick Carlisle. I don't understand. Are we not watching the same game when TJ McConnell comes into the game? Or am I watching the game from last year? It's very clearly the energy shift when TJ McConnell comes into the game. Um, Nee Smith, I don't need Nee Smith. Top in, he's getting what twenty three minutes. Twenty three minutes. See, I even know how many minutes he plays because when Carlisle is not doing anything different, he's just gonna keep doing the same thing until they lose another game and they're in Cancun swimming on the ocean. You know what I'm saying? Um. The utility guys, obviously Tatum Brown, Siakam, Turner White, Holiday Horford, Nemhard, McConnell. I mean, Neesmith can play, but I'm going to try not to play him. Obi Toppin if you're desperate. Pritchard if you're desperate. And I'm, I'm going to probably try not to go anything under Pritchard. Shepard, I tried. I played him. Uh, last five games, seven, ten, seven, twenty. I think this was it the blowout game? No. Yeah, it was. I don't know. I don't remember. I don't care. Seven, ten, seven, twenty, and nine. That's his last five games. You are what you repeatedly do. He, he he's not getting plays run for him. He's not. Grabbing much rebounds, he's not getting assists, he's not getting blocks, he's not getting steals, he's useless. He's just a waste of a spot. I'm not playing him. If he goes out there and hits six threes, good for him. I lose. I don't care. I'm not playing him. If you want to play Bobby Shepard or whatever his name is, you play him. I don't care. I'm not playing. I'm done with him. Um. All right, MVP, Tatum, Brown, Siakam, Turner, White, Holiday, Horford, McConnell. Maybe Nemhard if there's no Halliburton. Utility, Tatum, Brown, Halliburton, Siakam, Turner, White, Holiday, Horford, Nemhard, McConnell, Lee Smith. Topping if you must, Pritchard if you must, and that's where it stops. If I can't fit those guys in my lineup, then I'm not going to play the lineup. But I'm not playing Ben Shepard. All right, let's build a Tatum lineup, and then we'll build another one after that. Before we do that, if you're new here, welcome. Appreciate you taking the time to watch my video. If you're not subscribed, please subscribe. Hit the bell, thumbs up the video. If you are struggling to build winning lineups and you need help, you want me to send you my finalized optimal lineup, no problem. Check out the Patreon linked in the description. You can check out the channel memberships right here on YouTube. Silver and gold memberships to get you lineups also. We do have super chats available on YouTube. Okay, so let's build the Tatum lineup. <laughs> um obviously Tatum in the captain spot. Let's get my value piece out the way now. So we know what we're working with. Um Pritchard is 36, Toppin is 4K. Um, 
let's go top and you're gonna get 20 minutes out of him. You got Tatum, you got Toppin, you got 7K left. If we sneak in Holiday, Horford, if we pay up for, let's say we pay up for Siakam, that leaves us with Neesmith. Now what you're hoping for is you hope that Jalen Brown don't go off, but you know he's gonna get his unless he has a bad shooting night. Um, you hope Derek White doesn't go off. You hope Jalen Brown doesn't go off. You hope Miles Turner doesn't go off. But this lineup is not bad for a Tatum lineup. And you, you are looking for Tatum to go crazy and take like 20 cent shots. Let's clear this out. Let's do a Miles Turner lineup, 8K. So we're going to pop him in. Boom. Let's get some Jalen. Well, let's. Tatum takes a lot of shots. Let's just play Tatum. Let's just be safe. If you want to get cute, play Jalen Brown. If you want to play safe, play, get Tatum. And the only difference between those two is that Tatum takes a lot of shots. Um, So we go Tatum. Let's get our value piece. Let's get McConnell. Like, honestly, if there's no Halliburton, just shove McConnell up your ass, you feel me? Let's get Nemhard in there. If there's no, if there's no, um, if there's no Halliburton, we we'll, we'll have for sixty nine. It's probably pick. Let's see if we get, let's see if we get White. We get Derek White, and then we're still left with Nee Smith. So just throwing. No, let's see. Let's see. If we could get Horford. What we could get with that? You could get Horford and Holiday. So you could do White. And Neesmith or Horford and Holiday? I probably choose Horford and Holiday because of the Holiday. His range of outcomes. Um, he, like he could win, he could win you a tournament if he's getting some steals, he's getting some blocks. If if Drew Holiday is aggressive, then you're gonna be looking good. So this is gonna be my Miles Turner lineup. Listen, I'm gonna get out of here. I'm gonna let y'all get back to y'all festivities. You know, I could be on a I could be on a boat in the Hamptons partying with 50 Cent right now, but I choose to be, be here with you getting ready for our Monday slate. So, you know, make sure you drop, you know, let me get 2,000 likes on this video or whatnot. Look, I'm going to get out of here. Appreciate you guys. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the bell, thumbs up the video. Check out the Patreon link in the description. Check out the channel memberships. Super chats are open. 2,000 likes on this bad boy. And uh, I think that's about it. Talk to y'all later. Ciao.